The BJP, now the left as well, have closed in ranks and are supporting Raga's plea to depose before the JPC, probing the 2G scam, making matters difficult for the Congress, which is against Raja's deposition. Now, joining the same chorus is the left as well. The left has also supported Raja's plea to depose before the JPC, probing the 2G scam, making matters difficult for the Congress, which is against Raja's deposition because clearly, the Congress is worried if Raja claims to the JPC, like he has in court, that the Prime Minister was in the loop where 2G decisions were concerned, then once again, the demand for the Prime Minister to testify could increase. Let's quickly listen in. I have written a letter to him and earlier I had submitted a list of witness. Raja should be called. If Raja is not called, that will be an arbitrary and the work of JPC will have the shadow of a suspicion. All right, let's cut across to my colleague Atir Khan and Karthike Sharma, our deputy political editor. Atir Khan spoke to Gurdas Das Gupta, who got us this reaction there. But let's cut across to our deputy political editor, Karthike Sharma, who will help us make sense of all these reactions that we are getting in uh, Karthike. At this point of time, the Congress might be a worried lot. Uh, the chorus, the BJP, the left, galvanizing together, asking what's the harm if A. Raja testifies before the JPC, but the Congress knows what it might lead to, wouldn't they? Yes, it's a very catch-22 situation for the Congress party because if they call Raja in and uh, Raja is expected to name the Prime Minister and uh, now the Finance Minister Chidamram, uh, it's, it's going to be the biggest blow to this government because ultimately in the perception uh, the legality does not matter. And now they have decided not to call Raja, so which means that it will give enough order to the opposition parties to uh, attack the government that they, mm -hmm. they, are, they are trying to hide something. So both ways, it, 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 uh, it's a bad situation for the party to gain. Well, you're right, there is the government caught between a rock and a hard place there, uh, Karthik. It's a catch-22 situation for them, isn't it? Because this time, once again, like we've seen in the past, the allegations could directly be at the footstep of the Prime Minister's chair. Oh, yes. Uh, not only not only allegations, imagine Raja deposing before JPC in the middle of the session and saying that the Prime Minister knew it. Uh, I can guarantee you that the, the government, the functioning of the parliament will get affected immediately. And perhaps this is one reason why that uh, Mr. Chako is trying to avoid uh, Raja deposing before JPC on technical ground that he, that the, the, case, the criminal case is still on in the Supreme Court. It's a technical, it's a legal ground, but not a political ground. But then, then the issue is, is it fair in the process of justice to deny accused a fair hearing? Right. And I think that's where the government will lose.